YouTube is Mr. Zuni back out with another video and I'm going to talk about a couple projects. Um, but before I do, I want to get into the market real quick. The market has been uh, a little bit red today. Uh, Ethereum is, is, was, was hit the hardest out of Bitcoin and Ethereum. It's down about um, what, 4x. <laughs> a, a 6x or 6% right here. Uh, stock markets, they got a bad um, miss. Um, and we're probably going to get maybe the bad news for the rest of the year. It may be kind of a down, up, down market for the rest of the year. I think that's what it's kind of concluded. But we're not, it's never 100% sure. Um, a lot of analysts are saying we're going to go up and we're not. Uh, they're getting everything wrong in the market. And crypto is down too. Kind of odd today as well. BNB was up like two, three percent today, and then it finally just dipped, uh, lost its little peg there. But um, yeah, we we've had a, a little bit of a downturn in the market. Um, it could be it could be something where Bitcoin goes down even more. We may have a May twelfth uh, um, implication or same repeat. It's possible we may go down to the twenty five, twenty four thousand. Uh, not sure, but uh, if we keep having uh, rate hikes in the market, uh, we're probably going to have it in the rest of crypto as well. Um, Ames DeFi is one of my places where I like to store a lot of my stable tokens. Um, B B N B B U S D, um, and I'll convert it to Ames or A Share. I haven't really bought any any Ames or A Share honestly since the crash. Uh, this was more of a dip than a crash. The crash we had was when it was paired with UST and Ames was down at 10 cents and a show was down around like $6. So we've had a lot of just bad, uh, sediment, um, that day and we shot right back up and we were printing like crazy. Uh, just want to talk about like my, my strategy on what I'm doing. Um, usually I'm staking in these two pools. I've been, I went heavy into this pool after I got my tokens, um, when I got when I got in at, at ten cents, when we shot back up to a dollar, and um, I wanted to get more A share, and you know you're not supposed to <laughs> you're not supposed to uh, convert Ames to A share, but I wanted to get some more A share because I, I went heavy in the Ames, um, and then I rode that bad boy up as well. Uh, the the way to do this, or how to play this game, is to basically, uh, you know, if, if you want. There's a few different ways um, when they start implementing more ways. The easiest way is just to buy AIMS um, for this game. is just to buy AIMS and to stake AIMS. Um, you could do it in a single pool. Um, as you can see, you're earning 0.5%. You you are earning around a 1%, 1.5%. But now that we're kind of dipping and we, we had a crazy shot up, uh, run up and now we had a crazy drop down, I think the protocol is um, kind of taking a little bit of a break. And it's kind of good for the protocols to stop printing every now and again to kind of get, you know, um, the money, <laughs> everyone to stop selling as much because when you're earning AIMS or A share, people may sell. Um, but little do you guys know, I'm not sure if you guys know, but there is a cap on both. Now, A share, there's a cap on A, A, A share as well as AIMS. A share is a little more rare than AIMS. That's why um, if you were to buy the nodes, um, A share nodes, you're no longer able to get them. They're already out. They're gone. They're done. And then AIMS, you can keep printing. And if you buy AIMS share or AIMS nodes, um, you are guaranteed a 5x. So pretty much it's it's pretty easy to get a 5x on your money uh, with this protocol, uh, especially if you're just doing the node. Obviously, you're going to have to wait to get paid out, kind of like uh, Drip, um, but it is a stable, a stable token and it probably won't fluctuate as much. Um, you will have pro um, opportunities like right now. I did buy in around the 70, 70 cents or so mark um i was happy uh 70 uh 79 78 cents around that mark i did miss the bottom bottom um but i was able to catch a little bit of the dip so i'm already up um a little bit on that play uh we we were around the 89 cents we dropped back down to 88 cents so i should see this happening for the next couple of days we slowly increase um i was hoping we not hoping but i was trying to get more if we dipped any lower but we didn't kind of shot up really fast um and I'm happy with aims. Like what I usually do uh, in this situation when you're printing aims, uh, you t it would be the best strategy in this game is to buy uh, aims and then convert it to a share or to uh, 
a bonds are just bonds right so when you're able to buy bonds um, if you go over to um, the docs real quick I want to show you just the strategy um, that I was looking at and and if you guys are interested on in the bonds not a lot of people talk about the bonds uh, usually because this protocol is, it prints a good amount but I'm gonna take you to exactly right about here so there's two examples and um, in the game. So basically, which one is better? So let's say, you know, it's kind of similar to where I bought in. So if you bought in at 88, 80 cents, right? And you wait until, this is just buying AIMS. You buy just AIMS, you wait until it goes to a dollar or let's just say a dollar 15 and then um, and then sell your AIMS or, or, or whatever you're going to do with it, right? So you're going to earn 35 cents uh, per dollar on AIMS, right? Because you're accumulating that, the difference. But if you were to buy AIMS and burn it with basically using the bonds, um, this is a little calculator. Basically, you're earning about 47 cents instead of the 35 cents. So it's 12 cents more. So if you're buying a big, big bag, this can add up very quickly on each dollar or on each AIMS, basically. So um, this is basically a way not only to secure a bigger bag, but also help the protocol even more. So um, I highly recommend or encourage if you're playing this game to look at the white papers, the white paper and to pay, pay attention to what will help you benefit the best. Obviously, you're trying to make in this bear market, down market, you're trying to make your dollars uh, go as far as they can, right? Um, and, and what's good about DeFi and crypto is you don't need to throw a lot of money at these projects to make money. So like you don't need to ape into this. But if you were to get in a little bit heavier, this is a pretty much stable stable coin protocol. Obviously, it's not um, a true stable coin, but it, it does um, have a backing of the protocol and the team and as well as the players in it. And this has been a pretty solid play. Um, obviously, I've been watching this for well i've been in this for about a month and i've been watching it for maybe about a month so i've been looking at the into this project for about two months maybe a little bit longer um and i just been seeing the fluctuations it's basically how it goes um we go up we go back down it's kind of like a trading uh but it's a healthy part of the game and keeps it the sustainability um because you don't always want to keep printing all day long so for that that is how you can uh, benefit especially in in situations where we go below peg you get more on your aims or a share and as well um there is a little locking mechanism too because you do earn um now don't call me because i haven't uh exactly figured out what's the time weighted average price but um like for example if you wait but just reread over this and see if if you hold the longer you hold it it seems like the longer you hold the bond the more you get but I think that it just means that the longer you have, um, you hold it until like if it goes above a dollar, right? And it keeps going above a dollar and it runs, you're able to make more on that. Uh, but also too, remember, you're all always able to throw your um, your aims into the auto compounder, which is a crazy cool feature. It's kind of like a set it and forget it way to keep um, your, basically it helps the project out as well. Uh, you throw your money in these um, protocols here and you just keep on auto rebaking, auto recompounding, and it's pretty cool how it works out. Um, you could do it for AIMS as well and A share. So it's pretty neat how these work, um, and you don't have to mess with it. There is a, uh, there's no deposit fee as of right now. This should be coming up soon. They're gonna be adding a deposit fee, but the only thing you're gonna earn is a two percent. So, for example, if you're throwing it into um, AIMS or a AIMS is the same thing uh, as AIMS and, and um, AIMS BUSD and AIMS. So basically, you're earning the same um, a APR basically. So if you're earning, um, you know, basically 0.5, you're gonna want to have at least four days to break even um, when you withdraw it, right? Um, but that's not counting the compounding effect that's going into it. But it would just be uh, safe to take a screenshot of how much you put in um, and just pull out whenever you feel comfortable or whatever you're going to do. But in this case, like these projects are just printing you uh, paper money or printing you money. It's like a printing machine. So you can keep uh, compounding if you want. Some of these you can use is that you're never going to share. Uh, um, you're never going to sell. So you can throw them in these bad boys. 
and they just auto compound, which will grow your bag even faster. Um, rather than if you come in here every single day and try to do it, some days you miss, some days you don't, but the power of compounding is crazy. So don't take advantage of that, especially when there is no uh, deposit fee as of right now. So be uh, aware of that. And yeah, uh, it also um, I was looking at Alto Protocol. We are on a dip, <clears throat> as you can see. We're around that $15 range. I believe we are on that $15 range. Oh, why is it? Let's see, refresh. Um, pretty sure it's at the dollar, uh, $15 range. I don't know why why it's not, uh, why it's not uh, letting me open it for some reason. <laughs> there it is. Um, yeah, so we did get a, a little bit of a dip here, but we've been kind of riding this wave at an all-time high, right? Um, I was tempted to buy in at the $5 range, um, but I saw a better, uh, well, I calculated a better opportunity from Ames, uh, you know, getting the Ames at, at 10 cents and riding it back up to, I think the all-time high was 125 or 129. So, you know, you're able to make a good return on, on certain projects. And then, uh, what, what was it? Um, I can't remember the other project I got in that I made a um, decent return on just because of the dip. But yeah, this was easy. Uh, this one right here from five dollars to to thirty dollars was an easy well i almost went to thirty. i thought i went to thirty dollars well just let's call it a 5x um from five to twenty five dollars so you were able to make good amount of money on your bag even during the bear market which is crazy oh there it is we're down 13 percent on this bad boy um and what i like about um alto too is um, I do like their, their banking system where you're able to earn, I like this, the ETH and AIMS as well. So basically, you're earning a stable coin, a, pretty much a stable coin, and then two blue chip coins, right? So that is pretty cool. Obviously, these aren't the, um, you're not going to earn a, a whole lot of, of these because they're just like, you know, little little benefits that you get from holding the protocol but, you know, that these are the two projects um, that have been doing pretty well, and I'm pretty happy uh, about them. I ha Like I said, I'm not in Alto yet. Uh, I'm waiting for a good entry in this bad boy. Obviously, it's always good to wait, to be a little bit of patience, especially during the down market. We're not going to shoot up anytime soon. Uh, but I am missing that 2.3% APY a day, which is stable, a little bit different than AIMS. Um, and I'm waiting too because I, I want to say they they're gonna have they did have before where you can buy um you know Ames I think it was Ames or A share you could enter into Alto so yeah guys um, let me know in the comment section below I don't want to make this video too long but this is the couple projects I'm looking at um, I'm looking into as well oh um, I've been using my uh, my 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 diamond team member uh, to get to keep re replenishing my bag basically it's like an auto staker compound i've been i've been kind of taking more profits as of late getting my bags up uh keeping my bags up and just to make sure i won't get into these down projects and keep printing um also piggy finance is another one let's see if i can get an open one uh, piggy finance is another miner i've been very very happy with uh what did i do with it uh, i gotta i gotta reorganize all these i've kind of been uh, tweaking with them but um piggy finance is another one where you can, um, oops, I don't know what's going on with my, my computer has kind of been slow today. I think I've got to be started, but basically this is another staking protocol, which is pretty cool. See my other videos, I've had it, um, and I'm just kind of collecting my bags. Um, I'm, I'm doing a, a lot of it with Ames right now. Uh, it's been printing and I've been happy with it. And, um, honestly, some, some good, uh, another good gamification for this. When Asia runs up really, really high, you can, um, two things you can secure your bag with if you want to hold a share and don't want to sell it uh you can pair it with busd which protects it from the major correction so if you drop like 90 percent or 100 percent, you most likely would only dip 50 percent. so if you have a hundred thousand or if you have ten thousand dollars or a thousand dollars and you protect yourself with busd obviously you're going to be earning that one percent sometimes it's more like two percent a day um, most likely it's around the 2%, but we've been kind of hitting some rocky terrain, uh, uh, in the market. So, you know, that this fluctuates, um, with the protocol. Uh, but yeah, like I said, if you're, you know, you, if it goes down 90%, you're kind of protected a little bit with a BUSD LP. Um, so which is, which is good. And you're still earning your A share and you can do whatever you want to do with the A share. You can sell some of the A share for BUSD and kind of repair it with your, um, 
with your token. So basically, it's kind of a, a cool platform. Plus, there's no really no uh, fees in this platform. So what you make is what you make, and you keep everything, pretty much all of it. It's great. Um, and the boardroom too. We're gonna be <laughs> that's that's a high percentage right there. I, I said I was gonna make a quick video. Uh, this is a high percentage. So like when we start printing again. Um, it's always good to get back into this bad boy and um, reap the benefits of a 3% daily compound for as long as we can and then ride that baby right back up and it's kind of like the continuous game of uh, just <laughs> money making machine. Uh, anyways, guys, uh, those are my two uh, projects to keep your eye on during the bear market and down market um, and we'll see what happens and uh, yeah, guys, um, have a great rest of your day and I'll see you guys later. Peace.